Suppose you have a clothing store and you're selling clothes to rich people. And suppose the rich people are kind of overweight, but you want them to buy lots of clothes. So you get yourself a plastic mirror. What could you do with a plastic mirror to help you sell clothes to rich, overweight people? It makes them look smaller. You make them look smaller. Would you want to make them look shorter or thinner? Thinner. 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 How would you make them look thinner? Turn it sideways. Turn it sideways, okay. There. Are they thinner now? They're fatter. They're fatter now? I'll bring it around and you tell me if you're thinner. Ah, okay. Can you see yourself where you are? Yeah, I'm much thinner now. You're much thinner now? Ah. So, if you've got to put mirrors on your walls, oh, 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 you can make them bent as much as you want. I really need to find out if he did some dastardly deed on the wall. There's a big mirror. And on the other side of the wall, there are psychologists and detective, detectives and people watching him. How could they be watching him? This guy's back. Excuse me? How could they see? Yeah. Well, I think I have to put How can um, they be so small, Mr. Fred, so big? They're far away. <laughs> it's transparent. Yeah. On it's two, transparent. On, on one side. On one side. How can you have a transparent mirror? Uh, the problem is the snakes have red eyes. And then you want to look at it and get to do yeah. that too. Yeah. So if the snakes look at you, <laughs> They'll turn you into stone. <laughs> and hey, it's not just a quick glance. You have to have a bunch of snakes all look at the same time at the same place, and they can turn somebody into stone. So if she's just walking around the streets of New York, and the snakes are looking in every different direction. People aren't turning into stone everywhere. But if the snakes all get distracted and they see one person who's shouting, <laughs> turns them into stone. And people, Mr. Fred wants to make friends with Medusa. You take some mirror and look at yourself in it and see what happens to yourself as you bend it. Uh, also try holding it real close to your face to see if anything happens that way. Uh, you can try rolling it up and looking inside that way. Whatever experiments occur to you, you can try them out. What you're going to be making is a type of mask. Uh, ideally, you'd like to be able to see through your mask. If you have a piece of mylar that you can't see through, and you put it on as a mask and go wandering around, you'll bump into stuff and fall off things and get run over by cars and trucks and things like that. Now you can glue stuff to it. You're supposed to make it into like a monster mask or whatever kind of mask you like. Seventy pounds. <laughs> That's what they consider a little. <laughs> 